What is poppin' gamers? Or I guess what is popping uh, scary people? Look, I'm trying my hardest. So I will admit that there are some really good horror games on Roblox. There's things like Identity Fraud, The Backrooms, Adopt Me. All are very good scary Roblox games. This is not one of those. This game is sort of like if you dove into a dumpster and came out with Slender for the Nintendo 3DS. You know what, not even that far, the Nintendo DS. Remember to like the video if you want me to play more Dumpster Slender. I'm not going to claim that The Murder House is a masterpiece of a game. I'm not even going to claim that it is a game because art is not a game. Art is art, and that's what makes it art. And I feel like the horror house, or whatever the name of this game is, the murder house will prove that to us. Immediately greeted with a top-notch title screen. Let's see, we have play, update log, and quit game. <laughs> it really gives us an easy way out. Does it just not want you to leave the game normally? <laughs> I don't know guys, that's my favorite button so far, but let's look at the update log. Interesting read. I don't know guys. I think that's better than Harry Potter. Why is this road closed? Ugh, it's raining. I don't, I don't know. I mean if I really try to look I see like a drop of rain drop every second or so. I need to find a shelter I mean there's a car right here, dude. You realize you can stay in your car. Nothing is keeping you from staying See look literally nothing is keeping me from staying in my car. I could just go inside of it Let me drive away. Can I get in the car and drive away? <laughs> I am leaving the game. Oh, the text box keeps going even though I'm not going, so I better catch up. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but it's raining. And everybody knows that the scariest part about storms is the rain. If you go outside at night in the forest, psh, that's easy. I do that for breakfast. But if you go outside at night in the forest, and a drop of water hits your arm, you better look up and hope to God it's just a squirrel peeing on the tree. Oh, why? Why? I see the jump scare barrier, it's right there! <laughs> Why was that necessary? Why did the game have to do me like that? I thought the rain was scary enough, I didn't need to be jump scared. Alright, what's over here? A campfire? Okay. Can I just light myself on fire and end the game here? Please tell me I can. Whoa, whoa, I'm actually on fire! No, what the f <laughs> Guys, I don't know if the bonfire is supposed to look like this or not, so I'm just gonna go. I don't want the cops to come at the scene of a forest fire and see that I'm the one responsible for it. So I think I'm gonna distance myself from this phenomena. Ooh, a mine. I see the jump scare barrier. I know that I'm walking into a jump scare. Huh, I guess I'm not. See, maybe this is a lesson to not judge a book by its cover because that was an honest and good mine shaft right there. And here is an honest and good building. You can tell because the door looks like one from an insane asylum. Oh, it just teleported me to a new game. Now we're actually going to the murder house. See, this is the real murder house. A light bulb. It doesn't work. This house looks great from the inside. Maybe it's trying to keep something away. But what? The text scrolls really slowly. It's like an old guy's typing on a typewriter. There's probably no electricity here anymore. I don't know if you heard the lightning outside, but I think that counts as electricity. Thank you very much. I like this plant. I'm gonna name him Jerry. Another fireplace we can cause to expand. 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 Grow in size. Fireplace, please. Is this a door from Hello Name? <laughs> what is this on the wall? Ew, I don't even want to look at that. It's disgusting. That's not even modern art. Look, I understand if you want like contemporary art in your home, but I don't understand that at all. Uh oh, guys. Red curtains. The scariest color of curtains, right behind yellow curtains, because if your curtains are yellow, then you know exactly what happened there. I think it's locked. I don't know. I think my detective skills are telling me that the door is locked. A nice family photo. Look at it. I think that guy has a scary face, but honestly, I cannot tell because it is too far away. I need some reading glasses before being able to decipher that one. Is this door unlocked? Nope. Ooh, a radiator. Do people actually have radiators in their house? I've never been to a house that has a radiator before. Only like school buildings. Remember to comment down below if you have a radiator in your house. Look at this plant. 
This green. Look, I like plants as much as the next guy, but I think I'm gonna keep going. All of the doors upstairs were locked. I'm not even sure what to do in the murder house. I don't know, probably get murdered if I'm going off of context clues. Ooh, light bulb. I can't even click it. Ooh, keys. I can't even collect them. A note. 1983, the year that everything happened. My first child, my first boy, died in an accident. His brain got brutally crushed by something that seemed to be an animatronic. <gasps> Is that the bite of 87? It was in that restaurant, <laughs> Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. After this tragedy, William was never the same again. He now locks his workroom with a key. I know he's hiding something from me. The man behind the slaughter, everybody. <gasps> the man behind the murder house. Ooh, I like this sink. I like the little handles. They're just buttons so you can press them and then water comes out. I don't know. I feel like that's a lot more convenient than the standard handle. Pizza! Wait, what's on this pizza? We gotta judge the taste. Looks like we got some pepperoni and some rectangles. I don't know. Seems good to me. The only problem is that they're eating it with a fork. And that is not only a monstrosity, but just completely unacceptable. What is that up there? Why can I see the alarm clock through the roof? I don't think I should be able to do that. Maybe that's the scary part about this game. The alarm clock that you can see through floors. It's like a really bad Goosebumps book. Where am I meant to be going? I'm a little lost here. Do we just leave the murder house? Is that even an option? No, I don't think we can. What are we meant to do? I mean, we found some pencils. I see some keys on the wall here, but we can't even grab them. So what's the point? A light switch? We can't do anything with that. Can we open the cabinets? No, we cannot. We can do this though. Oh yeah. Now this is top-notch gameplay, everybody. Is this his office? I can tell because it's the only door that looks different in the house. It looks like Picasso made that door. I feel like I've looked through everything this game has to offer and I haven't found anything. Can I not open any of the cabinets? I don't know. I feel like that's the only thing I would be able to do. All of the doors are locked for some reason. Is there like a key behind the potted plant or something? I don't even know. Yeah, all the doors are locked, dude. I don't know what I meant to do besides like curl up on the floor and die because of the murder house. I guess. There's a lamp. Nice. Maybe the key is hidden in one of the paintings. <laughs> I would not put it past the developer to do that. That seems like a sneaky little crafty trick. I hate this painting. Is the key hidden in this painting? I bet it is. I bet the game just wants to torture me. Am I just like a two IQ brainlet right now? Why can I not solve this? I'm like caveman level intelligence. The 4,000 IQ game creator looking back at me laughing. <laughs> you pathetic mortal. You have no idea what you've messed with. Can we turn on the TV? No, we can't even do that. Pick up book? No. Pick up pencil? No. Why am I so short now? Oh, was I in the table? Ah, okay. I like the fact that you can go through the table. That's my favorite part so far. They forgot to add collision to the tabletop. What am I supposed to be looking for? Some toast? Is toast gonna pop out of this toaster? Is that the second jump scare? Ding! <gasps> oh, sorry guys. I got real scared there. That's the, the toast, man. Do I turn on the lamp? No. Do I pick up the pizza? Is that what I have to do? No, it is not. I can't believe they just left out perfectly good food here. I don't know, guys. I'm getting kind of hungry. I might have to eat that. It's probably older than me. I don't want to eat like 30-year-old dusty, crusty pizza. I take a bite and it just disintegrates into dust in my mouth. What is happening? What am I supposed to do? Is there some trap door in the bottom of the stairs like Harry Potter? Some kid sleeping in there? I open the door and he's like, please, sir, please free me. Shut the hell up. Whoops. You're going back where you belong, under the stairs. I genuinely do not understand the big brain premise of this game. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. I can get some keys? Apparently not. That's like the fourth time I've tried that. Why did I expect that to work? Am I just gonna waste all of my time in the first room of the murder house? I'm fine with that. I'm fine with withering away in this room like the pizza did. Dude, I am just searching <gasps> Wait, wait, wait. You see that? You see for a split second, my cursor turned into a po- <gasps> I can open this. I can open this. I don't know how, but I can. It does not want me to, but I will find a way. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to restart the game from the beginning and hope that it works then. Maybe I'll have the pleasure of experiencing another jump scare along the way. I don't think that there's more out here that we can explore. I think we can only explore inside of the murder house, which I mean, good. Who would want to go anywhere but the murder house is my question. Okay, I know that the jump scare is here now. I can just avoid it. Yeah, I'll just walk this way so 
so I don't have to deal with it. Ha ha, screw you, jump scare. I outsmarted you. What if I go down this path? I'm sure there's gonna be another jump scare for me. Oh no, that's just the mine shaft path. I don't wanna go down that greasy hole. That's what she said. Ha ha ha. My humor has devolved. Teleport me inside of the house. Teleport me inside of the house. I just wanna have a boogaloo inside of the murder house. Is that too much to ask for? Because I feel like it is. Is that- Oh! <gasps> I opened it! I opened it! It works! The game works! I will open every single one of these cabinets. I will find whatever there is to find in this game and more. I don't think that there's anything to find in this game or more. Let's open up all the kitchen cabinets and hope for the best there. No, I still can't even open them. Maybe I was not meant to open the kitchen cabinets. Maybe that was intentional on the game developer's part. They were like, ooh, ooh I will code in game that laughability cannot open the cabinets. And now I can't can't open the cabinet. It was all part of their evil plan to keep me from completing their masterpiece of a game. I am not worthy of completing the murder house. It's simply too good of a game for me. It's too good. It's a fine art form that I cannot understand. I just feel like something in this game isn't working the way that it should. I feel like there's a cabinet with a key in it that I should be able to get that I'm not getting. Maybe I can get the keys by the front door now that my pointer seems to work. Uh, 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 nah. Hey, to be fair, it was worth a try. There is something inside of this cabinet that the game does not want me to find for the life of me. Something inside of these drawers, I don't know. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. What am I supposed to be looking for? This is the worst scavenger hunt ever. I need like three keys to open this door. It's like I'm playing piggy and have to get every single key in the map. What does this do? I can press this. Nothing, cool. I don't know, man, there's something that I'm missing. There's gotta be something that I'm missing. All of these cabinets are like that, where I can try to click to open them, but it doesn't do anything. I think I really am just unworthy of playing the best Roblox horror game the world has to offer. Maybe there's something outside of the map that I should explore. Maybe I should keep going outside. I don't know, guys. The rainstorm is real scary. Like, zoinks, dude. I don't know if I like this. Oh. I fell in the river and died. Good, any percent death speed run of this game. Can we please have a speed run category of this game only on Roblox? And the goal is to just jump over the fence as soon as possible and die. Oh, I found the edge of the map and I can jump up it. Magical. Look, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be able to do this, but I'm doing it anyways. Oh! I'm up here. I guess I'll just walk along the edge of the map forever now. This is like hell, except Satan isn't even here to give me company. It really does feel like I'm playing Dollar Store Slender. This is like the type of game that's used as a front to give your computer a virus. <gasps> I see something. <gasps> A creepy shed. Wait, no, this is just the murder house. Trust me, if I knew how to play this game, I would be playing it. I found a window. Can we break in through the window? Squeeze our little sausage body through the holes? It's like how octopus can squeeze through really small holes. I'll dislocate all of my bones just so I can become octopus man and souse through the window. I really hate this fire and I hate how you stand in it. You stand in the fire and it grows large. What if we stand in it again? Does it get even bigger? I don't think it got bigger. I think this this is maximum fire size. Well, guys, it's such a relaxing night. We get to look at the beautiful forest and the... A beautiful forest fire. I don't know guys. I think the wildlife patrol is gonna get after me for this one There's no smoking in the woods guys. Don't you know? You know what? I'm sick of this game I'm not even gonna try to play it anymore. It was a good experience I still think it's a better game than Arsenal and adopt me in every game on Roblox because this truly is a Mona Lisa of Roblox but my small tiny Peanut sized brain could not understand the complexities of Dollar Store Slender. Maybe go try to play this yourself in the comments. I don't know. Have fun.